What's good? What's good? It's the one the only, but what do I know? Boxer coming back at y'all with another one, man. So, yeah, as everybody should already know, by now, Ryan Garcia has missed weight, and he is now responding to him missing weight via Instagram. This is his verified Instagram account. He said, why would I force myself to make weight so I can be weak? Uh, because you signed on the contract? Nah, I'm here to win. That's it. I told y'all I would never put myself in a position to lose again. No tank repeat where I lost myself on the scale. This my ish now. So guess what, guys? Do you guys know what that means? That means now, once again, Ryan Garcia is not fighting for a title. This was supposed to be his first time even fighting for a title, and he has now messed that up by missing weight. I mean, bro, at this point, bro, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to take, I'm gonna, I promise you, I would not be surprised if after this fight, is should he lose this fight if he checks himself in to a mental health facility? All right, he then goes to say, F all that Viva Mexico, Viva Mexico, we're leaving with his head. The, uh, the belts will always be there. We're leaving with his head. So basically, talking about um, Devin Haney. Now, okay, I'm going to stay this sidebar and then I'm going to get back on it. For all y'all that have an issue with Deontay Wilder saying he wants a body, I just want to hear what you guys got to say about uh, about um, about Ryan Garcia talking about wanting to leave with his head. All right, I just I, for, for, just just for the vlogs and everybody, the WBC uh, who had an issue with De, uh, Deontay Wilder saying he wanted a body on his resume. I want to know, do y'all have an issue with this right here? Granted, he's not fighting for your title because the man is not made uh, making weight. I, 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 you know what? After this fight, bro, everybody just needs to be done with Ryan Garcia in the sport of boxing because this is ridiculous. Um, the man has pr showed time and time again that he is just not taking anything serious. Now, at first, I did believe that this was a good promotion for the fight, but now it, it wasn't until, bro, Boxing Ego, shout out to Boxing Ego, this man shared a video of Ryan Garcia at a, at a nightclub singing Love by Keisha Cole the week of the fight. Why are you doing that, bro? The the man was getting drunk, uh, doing videos with that Jalen, uh, that Jalen chick, uh, trying to kiss on her, have you know, uh, sexual relations with her or whatnot, and 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 this is two weeks before the fight. Are you serious, bro? So at this point, bro, do we even continue to give Ryan Garcia a, a, a um a, a, a chance? Not I'm not even talking about as far as him winning this fight. But I'm talking about as, as far as boxing in general, do we continue to give him a chance? Because this man has showed time and time again that he's not taking his career serious. Now, I give him credit for doing whatever he had to do to make the Tank Davis fight because that was a big money fight. But this man obviously does not care about his legacy. He doesn't even care about becoming a world champion. As evidence, the man did not make weight. Now, you, you moved up to 140 in, uh, when, when was that? Maybe a year or two ago? And, you know, I mean, just hasn't done jack shit. I mean, even at 135, the man refused to fight for a title when he was Devin Haney's mandatory. So it's like, I just, I don't, I really just don't have any faith in Ryan Garcia and his career. And honestly speaking, bro, I don't think that De La Hoya or Bernard Hopkins should be wasting their time on him. I would actually much rather see Tank, uh, I mean, not Tank, I'm sorry. Uh, I would rather see Devin Haney against the likes, against Arnold Barboza than to see him against Ryan Garcia, right? Because it's just, Ryan Gar I don't trust Ryan Garcia, bro. It wouldn't surprise me if in that fight, uh, Ryan Garcia gets so frustrated that he just quits. It, it, I promise it wouldn't surprise me, bro. He gets so frustrated just based off the fact that Devin Haney, he can't hit Devin Haney, or he's made, like it wouldn't surprise me if he just quits, bro. If he just quits, and then just has everybody looking like stupid that pay purchase this fight, bro. Like I'm gonna be honest, man. I, I listen. I I went at, I I went against my grain because I I wasn't gonna support this fight. Uh, I, I wasn't gonna buy this fight due to Ryan Garcia, but I do want to support Devin Haney, so I went ahead and bought this fight. I went ahead and bought the fight um, because I do want to support Devin Haney, all right? So I went ahead and bought the fight, but bro, I, I promise you, man, Ryan Garcia has turned this whole fight into a train wreck, bro. And again, at first I was with the whole, I'm thinking like, okay, maybe he's promoting this fight and he's doing a damn good job of it, bro. He got people talking about him and this, that, and the third. But the fact that this man done, done miss weight, bro, like, man, you, you not, like, bro, nah, nah. As a matter of fact, 
Did he already tease about not uh, not making weight? Matter of fact, let me go ahead and play the clip right quick. Oh, crazy. Right. How you feel about like your weight? Like How you feel about your weight right now? Are you gonna make weight? And is there any consequences to missing the weight in the contract? No consequences. I'll miss that shit if I want. You win the fight. It's my event. So, you, so you don't think I'm you gonna make the weight? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You win the fight. Bro, I'm gonna make the weight. It's easy. Fight. You win the fight. Three fights you wanna make. Bro, this this right here, man, like, uh, I just don't see how anybody at this particular time, or particular time, I'm sorry, could take this man serious, um, just overall, because the man is obviously not wanting to, uh, he just, he he wants to be in big events, kind of like Roley, or, but the only thing is, at least Roley wanted a title, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's sad that Roley has done more in his legacy than Ryan Garcia. Now, obviously, uh, I'm not talking about uh, financially, but in his legacy, he has done more than Ryan Garcia. So, by becoming a world champion. And Ryan Garcia doesn't even care enough about his legacy to even try to become a world champion, bro. Like, this... I, I just honestly at this particular time, dog, I don't really see how anybody could uh, continue to support this man, bro. It's just, uh, it, it's, it's. I don't, I don't even care. To, like I said, after this fight, bro, if they never me mention Ryan Garcia in the sport of boxing, I promise you, I won't care because this, this man is not. He, he's, he's making a fool out of his own fan base, bro. Excuse me, I'm eating peppermint. For y'all that's sitting here going to bat and going to war for Ryan Garcia, he's making a fool out of y'all, bro. The man, uh, the man don't care. He don't. He just want the money. That's it. And ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with wanting the money. But if you in a sport, bro, you know at least try to do something for your legacy, bro. Now this man, I don't know. Um, it's two options. Um. They can negotiate and make this fight a catchweight fight at 143, but then that would be um, a contradiction to what Ryan Garcia had to say with Tank Davis. He was upset at Tank Davis for making that fight at a catchweight of 138. Now he wants to fight at a catchweight of 143. Or Devin Haney, more than likely, what's going to happen. Because I didn't even watch the weigh-in. I mean, I didn't watch the press conference last night. But I did see on uh, somebody's headline saying that Ryan Garcia was betting 500K that he would make weight. Oops, dummy. But you know what? He probably don't He don't care. 500K. What's 500K when you made? Well, 500. I don't give a damn. 500K is a lot. But anyways. Um, or, uh, right. Devin Haney can um, go ahead and tax Ryan Garcia, which probably more like more than likely that's what's going to end up happening. Devin Haney's probably going to um, tax Ryan Garcia for those past pounds because if you not if you guys don't know, uh, it's different weight class. I mean, it's different um, different clauses for each uh, you know uh, contract, but for every pound you miss overweight, you owe um, you know that somebody might tax you. Um, they don't might they'll tax you. You know. Your uh your your purse, you know, or whatever. So he probably gonna have to cough up probably like a mil and a half to uh probably 1.5 to, to Devin Haney. More than likely that's probably what's gonna end up happening. But you know, it's just crazy, man, because you know you normally don't see fighters miss weight by three pounds, man. Normally when a fighter uh misses weight, it's all it's about like maybe like uh five, you know, five ounces overweight or whatever the situation may be. This man missed three missed weight by three pounds, bro. He wasn't even trying to make weight. And, and as you guys can see, he just basically stated that he wasn't. He's not even trying to make weight. So it's like, bro, I don't. At this point, how do you take? I don't. I just don't see how y'all take this man serious anymore, bro. Ryan Garcia, like, should he lose this fight now? If he wins this fight, I don't know. If he wins this fight, he. I, I don't. I don't know where he. I don't know. I still don't know. But it would. It would not surprise me in the least bit. If he loses this fight, if he ends up checking into a mental a mental health facility, bro, wouldn't surprise me at all. Sad situation, bro. I don't know what to say about dude, but I, I know I, I know this. I know he better get the same criticism that like guys like Shakur got when he missed weight. Man, I think this is the first time ever missing weight, Ryan Garcia. Yup. It's crazy. 
it's crazy man but <sighs> it is what it is man uh the fight is still going on the uh devin haney or and ryan garcia both stated that the fight is still going on i guess they're gonna do a ceremonial weigh-in uh this afternoon i don't know if ryan well apparently ryan garcia is not even gonna try to make the weight because he just stated that you know it is what it is he ain't gonna kill himself to make weight he just won't be fighting for another title and that's sad but it is what it is let me know what you guys think about Ryan garcia i mean ryan garcia make sure you guys like comment subscribe but what do i know